Uh, my name is Walter Wood. Uh, my nickname is Gene, G-E-N-E, and uh, I'm a graduate of Georgia Tech, and Bill's a graduate of uh, University of Wyoming. We're both professional mechanical engineers. And you can see some of my uh, certificates on the wall behind me, uh, and uh, my Georgia Tech paraphernalia. So uh, we want to uh, introduce ourselves in this video and to let you know that uh, the gyro principle is a technical reaction for a, a moving a gyro. And uh, we're all familiar with the if forces of equal and opposite uh, reaction forces, but we are not familiar with gyro principles. And it uh, fools us uh, very much, it's very tricky, and is used today for stability, for camera platforms, and also uh, even ships. Uh, but it is not used for motion. Uh, the motion comes in from the fact that we continually move the gyros. And as uh, you can see, in equal opposite forces uh, is, uh, uh, is known very well today. But in a gyro, I want to demonstrate with my fist here uh, how the gyro reacts. It goes as you push, it goes like that. So it is very violent force that can be used. But it is uh, definitely usable. And uh, we, we think this uh, very beneficial as we put it in our machine. Thank you. In the next video, we'll show a small model of what we plan to do in our next phases of our uh, experimentation and, and modeling. And the next, uh, the modeling, I want to encourage you to click on the strong model, we call it, that is made out of metal in a machine shop with two motors, a half horsepower motor and a three-quarter horsepower motor. Uh, the next model that I show in the next uh, video will be a very, very small toy model. And thank you for looking at our ideas and considering it. Thank you.